Heading into map number seven, we have Team Caliber up 4-2 in the series. This could potentially be the last map of the night, Benson, as a Team yep. Caliber, they're on Pro Scrim Point. If they win this, they're going to take it over to Unite. Well, you know, it's hard point now, and we've seen some uh, interesting plays from both teams on yeah. hard point. You know, the, the first hard point of the evening was very, very close, let's put it that way. The, the second, though, it went to Unite, so both teams have won one hard point each. Hard point slums, uh, it's idea, such a small map, it sees so many good engagements, all about holding that back fountain spawn. Potential 120 points to be won from two hard points just from holding one spawn. And Unite actually had the good spawn straight off the bat, so TK, they're gonna need to flip it relatively quickly, and that's exactly what they're trying to do. Goonjar pushing this left hand side, already managed to get one kill. In fact, I lie, he's already managed to get two kills now as he tries to pick Make up the kill three. on the hard point. Three, Make it four, four. Can he find Make the it bed? five. Oh. God, Goonja, there's the 200 from the hill as well. He's going to have some serious amount of streaks. Goonja, I, oh, just wow. Just, just wow. Yeah, so these score streaks are definitely going to help out when we go back to the white wall, when we go to a garage. Now, I do not want to see him use them on this current hard point or the next hard point after this. I mean, if he uses the lightning strike to break, great. You could get maybe, you know, 50 seconds out of that. But if he uses them to break the white wall, uses them to uh, break that hard point and get the anchor spot, we could potentially get a team 120 points. But Unite, they're currently in the lead by around 12 points after this hard point expires. And we'll see how TK decides to break this. This map, it's all about your anchor players, so the pressure is going to be on Ricky here. He's going to have some help from Embos, who's staying alive inside the side of Archway, but he's going to wind up getting cleaned up as Saints is going to rotate over to help him along with Ricky here. Let's go on board with the anchor player, as uh, we're going to see how he decides to play this Unite. They're getting a lot of time out of this current hard point. Gunjar trying to fight through the archery here. Ricky looking for the kill, finds it. One more player challenging from Cop Car. That's going to be Theory. And look at the spawns from Unite. They all spawned out. It's going to be Sharp here. Getting the cutoff behind Blue. Taking some fire now. He's going to duck down. Can he pick up the kill? Nice one on Nameless. Oh, can he find the third? It's going to be Ricky shutting him down. But TK, they made some great plays and they're going to be able to tie up the game if they get the rest of these points. Actually, they're going to be in the lead by around five points. Yeah, and you can see Unite are going to completely give up that time. And TK is just going to say, thank you very much. We'll take that last remaining 13 seconds. But as you can see, this is where it comes important. It's going to be Unite with the spawn. Now, Gunja, when is he going to use those streaks? He's going to, uh, he's pulled out the lightning strike now. So I expect him to see, pull it down on the anchor. But there is actually no one on that fountain. There's two players actually inside that garage. So Unite, knowing Gunja had those streaks, played that very intelligently because of that. That lightning strike has, has pretty much been wasted, Revan. Yeah, Gunjar picks up two, though. Hill currently empty. Gunjar, he's going to use the Hellstrom missile. So sees that, hey, you guys are all in laundry. I'm not going to be able to kill you. But Saints also had his own light, own Hellstorm missile. He picks off Gunjar and Unite. They're doing a fantastic job. Uh, also, some misuse of score sheets by Gunjar. I didn't really kill anybody with that. Saints goes big. Two kills to his name as he finds his way back into the hard point. And Unite, they maintain spawns. They maintain position. And they're going to get a lot of points off this hard point. And the question is, when are TK going to break that anchor? Because if they don't do it soon, you know, this could get out of control. Unite could pick up, like I said, 120 points up for grabs. Oh. You control this half point and obviously the next half point when it rotates the oh, garage. Wow, nice break. So much free time being given away right now is it's actually TK who have put the spawn. So nice play coming from them. Hyunja, he's going to be sat on that hill. Desperately trying to claw back this deficit. Going to pick up the remaining four seconds. And it is going to be Unite actually on the next hill early on as well. Yeah, and those takes the car explosion. Thankfully, he's got some flak jacket on. So he's going to be able to live through that. Now it's all about garage here. Usually we see a lot of contesting going on inside this current hard brain, but Unite. They're able to pick up three kills, but Team Cobbler, they still have good spawns, except for Sharp, who spawned out all the way on the other side of the map. So Unite, they're going to be fighting you know, pretty much four on three, but one of their teammates did spawn out as well. Gunjar, he's on a three kill streak. Embo's on a four, Our so we're going to see if Embo's can get any score sheets here. Now it's going to be up to Gunjar. He's dead as well. Saints in the hard point. He's only got four bullets, but not enough to pick up the kill as Theory breaks it. Well, Gunjar did pick up another Hellstorm and another Lightning Strike just off that quick 200 points he managed to get from this current half point. 20 seconds remains before it rotates. It's 91 to 61 in favor of Unite and Unite building a bit more of a lead. Gunja has that gunfight, needs to try and pick it up, does so. Gonna get another 200 points, just trying to juggle the half point a yeah. little bit there. One Unite player just outside there. Sharp is gonna shut down Nameless, who was around the outside, and another important last few seconds that Gunja is gonna pick up, but Who's going to have control over the middle hill? It's going to be Unite and Gunja. I'm surprised to see that he didn't actually call in those streaks a little early before he got EMP'd. And still choosing. There we Using go. Using the lightning strike here. here. You yeah. know, I think the lightning strike is a lot more valuable than the Hellstorm missile. I think he definitely should have used the Hellstorm. He didn't even pick up a kill with the lightning that, strike. That's his third streak. But now he's that. using the Hellstorm missile. Well, he should have just let off with this. But he's going to be able to make two kills. Actually, one is his teammate. So even trade there for both teams. And Gunja picks up the kill on Saints. 
as Team Calvert, despite that, they still have control of the hard point. Gundrag is going to be able to find one more cleans up Nameless, but he's going to get challenged again. Embo's cleaning him up. Let's go on board with Nezlo, who's inside the hard point. And he's going to be doing some damage from in here. As he gets taken out, I want to go full screen. Let's take a look at our scoreboard. And, you know, it's looking like Unite has more kills overall than Team Caliber. And that's reflected in this total score as well. I mean, nine defends come from Saints as well. Whereas Team Caliber, they only have two, three, four, five defends combined. Saints with more defense than all yeah. TK put together. That's that's a crazy Winner stat right there. Fantastic plays being made from Saints, and that's exactly why Unite have the lead at this point, and they're building it as well. 50 seconds as the halfway has just rotated now. It's 119 to 87. Still 4 minutes 38 still to play. It's going to be Ricky who's going to be trying to anchor here for Unite. It's all the players seem to be rushing towards him. He's got nothing but hit markers. Needs some help from his teammate. His name just comes in from behind. He's going to pick up a few kills there. And TK still spawning out. I mean... You have to say, Gunja has wasted essentially four kill streaks now. Yeah. This could come back to haunt TK. Yeah, Ricky doing a great job on the anchor spot here. He's not dying. And now Nameless, he's got full streaks and he's putting them to use right now. But Gunja's flak jacket going to be able to waste some of those war machine shots. As Embos picks up two, Unite, they regain control of the hard point. And now they're starting to build a bit of a lead here, Benson. They're up by around 60 points, and they're already beginning to rotate. Now he's got score streaks to break this current hard point. I think they're going to give it one push with their guns and then see if they could break it with those. But here comes the lightning strike. He knows there's one in laundry, one near blue, and the other player spawned out. He's actually just going to ping it. He used the Hellstorm missile, and they should be able to clear out the hard point with this. Oh, well, he actually didn't. He's actually been dodged, and now Ricky needs to try and get on that hill. He is going to find Neslo, picks up the kill, picks up the 200 as well. Hardpoint gets contested almost immediately. And TK, they are, have their backs against the wall. They're just about to hit that 100 point. 56 seconds behind. Theory trying to make some moves on that hill. Wasn't gonna able to happen. Gujar, he's still on there. Picking up a nice shot there on Saints. In comes the lightning oh. strike. That's going to take off three people. And Unite are going to have the spawns and the hill control. Expect them to, to at least hit 200 points before TK get back on control of the hill. Yeah, rough spot for Caliber right now. But Embo staying alive inside the hard point. Switching over to this MP7. Trying to do some damage with this. He's going to find two players here. Picks up one. But the War Machine from Nameless will help him out there. Nice shots, but eventually cleaned up here by Sharp, who's trying to make a last-ditch effort for Team Cobber. Get as many scrapping points as they can. And almost finds the kill there on Ricky. But we're moving over to the garage. And who's already there? Unite. Saints, he's going to be able to get these capture points as they're going to be trying to breach the 200-point mark here. And, you know, if they hold a lot of this time, they're going to be able to go up by over 100 points. Uh, yep. above Team Caliber, so good stuff coming from Unite, showing uh, their hard point game off, and I'm looking at the mini-map, looks like Team Caliber, they were able to make a great push here, it's going to be sharp inside the hard point. Well, I'm just having a quick look at that scoreboard, you got Gunja 28 and 16, and Neslo not having the best of games, currently 12 and 26, we're so used to seeing him, you know, sort of top the leaderboard with so many kills, and right now he's running around with the M8, has managed to take down Saints on that hill, and he's going to push out as well, 25 seconds left before it rotates, picks up Embos, that's going to put him at two kills to his name, and this could be the start of a TK comeback, there's going to be two hills uh -huh. left. As, and there's no going big right now. Three kills, make that four. As soon as I call him out for not having the best of games, he lights up. And this is what I like to see coming from Neslo. Can he try and earn those score streaks though? Because that could be game changing on these last two hills. One more heading towards blue, picks up the assist on that one. Is currently EMPD, knows there's going to be players on that hill. He needs to get this blue control. And you can see on our mini map, there's going to be no one in there towards the blue side. And I think TK, they actually have control of the spawns as well, Revan. Yeah, so Neslo, if he gets one kill here, He's going to get score streaks, which could help turn things around. He oh, doesn't find it there. And these score streaks could help TK out so much, especially coming yep. into these last final hopperts. Now, if they get the rest of these 40 seconds, they're right back in the game, Benson, and they have a pretty good setup. Nezo, he's going to find some kills over near Graveyard. Still looking for that one elusive kill. He's going to find there it here. Is. Picks up the Hellstorm, picks up the Lightning Strike, working towards the War Machine now, as well as Gunjar. He's close to some score streaks as well. He gets cleaned up, though. Nezo putting in work. This is where it matters. Here comes the Hellstorm Missile. He's going to find two near bricks. Might kill himself, but it doesn't matter. He gets the players off the hard point while his teammate Sharp and Theory here racking up the time. And here we go. 15 seconds remaining. If they pick up this time, they're only down by 20. Uh -oh. But there is one player, Nameless. He flipped all the way around. He's trying to get the spawns for Unite Gaming here. Sharp can't pick up the kill on the hard point. Theory's there to clean it up. So they're going to get the final couple of seconds here. The Lightning Strike coming out. Cleans up Nameless. Cleans up Saints. And Ricky, oh, can this be the comeback for Team Caliber? 40 seconds remaining. Only 20 seconds now. Separate both these teams.
38 seconds left, 201 to 190. It's going to be TK on that hill. They still have the spawns. Great anchoring being done by Sharp. Oh. He's just put himself completely out of contention. There's absolutely nothing Unite can do. Get they on the hill. Get on the side. hill, Team Caliber. The, the Sharp, the Sharp's going to pick up an easy three kills here as Dujar rotates all the way around the outside. No one's on the hill, though. And finally, they do go back. 18 seconds left. That's going to do it. Dujar's going to get the kill. 15 Team seconds left. Team Caliber. Unite spawn out. Fantastic With plays. the co craziest comeback. One of the wow. best comebacks I've ever seen. And it was really Nestle right there. Getting yeah. those score streaks, able to maintain position here for Team Caliber as they come back in the final two hills of Hardpoint. And they're going to take your pro scrim right here with a total map count of 5-2, to two, I believe. Unbel unbelievable. I, I can't believe we've just seen a comeback like that. That was that must have been, I think it was a 50-60 point comeback in a, in a row. And that was all, exactly like you said, Reverend, down to Neslo. As soon as I caught... Well, it looks like we've lost Benzin here, I think... Um, uh, the computer we were using for Skype, it ran out of battery, but nonetheless, crazy comeback for Team Caliber as uh, they take over as Pro Scrim champions. We're going to have to get them on again to defend their title. I mean, that's just such a crazy series back and forth, but Team Caliber proving too strong in the end. So if you missed any maps from tonight, head over to our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash official MLG COD. We're so close to 150,000 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for the support. And I hope you enjoy the content that we're going to be producing in the near future. But that's going to be it for Unite uh, for today. Now, go follow both these teams on Twitter at Unite Gaming and at Team underscore Caliber with a K. As well as you can follow me at RevanJB or Benson at Benson underscore EU. But that's going to be it for tonight. Until next time, we'll see you guys later.